Vines and Cellar is a micro winery where you can come in for a sample, a glass, or a bottle of wine. We encourage people to bring their dinners in or they can bring snacks in. In addition to selling wine retail, we also do a process called UVIN where you can become the vintner. And uh, that starts by doing some sampling at the bar. Um, you decide on the variety of wine you want to make. And 95% of the time we have all of the supplies needed to make those varieties that we carry retail here. Uh, at that point, my husband Jim will um, go over the process of winemaking, the equipment, and all the supplies that will be used. The customer starts the batch up, and then during the next four to eight weeks, we do the maintenance on the wine. And uh, when it's time to bottle, the customer comes back for the bottling, corking, and custom labeling. Gives them a personalized uh, bottle of wine, but in actuality is one of the varieties that we carry here in the shop. I was looking for supplies online for our hobby winery in the basement and I came across uh, um, these business models out of Canada and they were micro wineries and I showed it to my husband and I said doesn't that look like fun so we went on a five-state tour of franchise and independent wineries that are similar to this between Wisconsin Ohio Indiana and Illinois and we picked and choose what we liked out of it took some notes and then decided we were gonna just jump in on it um, and haven't looked back since. When we first went into business, we discovered that because we don't grow the wines and have pick tickets for all of the juices, we needed to have fanciful names uh, for um, many of the wines. So we had an open house and we opened a bottle of everything and had people uh, suggest what they should be called. Well, it started with Australian Shiraz uh, being a taste of Sydney. She's one of our nieces. So each niece and nephew has a wine, um, along with my grandma, who has uh, Boucher's Delight, which is a green apple Riesling. And for the kids anyways, we've decided to donate a portion of the proceeds from that bottle, depending on how many they sell per month to their college fund. So if you come to the winery, definitely have one of the kids' wines to uh, at least sample. One other tangent of our business is we carry beer and winemaking supplies for home um, wine and beer makers. I think all of our customers become part of our family. Um, we have brides that uh, will uh, borrow glassware for their wedding on to uh, customers that uh, call when they're on their way up here and if we're in the middle of bottling they'll come and l lend a hand. So it's uh, not just a store, it's more like a family place for people to hang out and have a good time.